Hey guys, my name is Cidiac and welcome back to another episode of Hit It Potato Apple. Well, you guys seem to love in the uh, last few recent episodes so much. We're back with another one. And guess what, guys? Since we last did some sweet, sweet expansions to our airport, not only did we get three additional smaller and we, well, two and four. Four, I can't even count. What's going on? Uh, smaller air uh, runways. We got three large ones, which is now accepting Concords and more of the big boys. Turns out your boy made a bobo. I named one of the planes wrong. I am so damn foolish. So damn foolish. But we're now getting uh, the Beechcraft, the Boeing uh, 777s, the A320s, the 737s, uh, the Q400s. I believe we're getting the 747s, uh, the Concords, the A380s. The only thing that we are now not getting is the C17s and the Belugas. And there's only one reason why we're not getting them. Because they are freaking cargo planes! So we need to kind of convert our airport to be able to start accepting cargo planes. And then we truly are going to be making so much freaking cash money moolah. So guys, if you do enjoy this episode, want to see more of Itty Bitty Airport, or maybe you want to see some of Itty Bitty Railway, guys, smash the like button down below! And if you are new around here, make sure you do subscribe so you get notified when the next episode does come out. Right, here's a plane here, guys. Is this the triple seven? Am I right? Am I right or am I so damn foolish again? Uh, no, it's the 747. Anyway, <laughs> so we need to get um, cargo planes landing. So I believe to get cargo planes, we already have the large runway, which is already installed. We got the large ATC tower, which is already installed right now. So we pretty much have, uh, I think that, I'm not sure if that's a large one or this large one. So we pretty much have everything that we kind of need right now. The only thing we don't have is the jetway to allow the cargo to park. And I think we need warehousing as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually separate this building as its own separate building. Oh, oh my goodness me, that, yo, excuse me sir, your plane's nearly hit my airport. Uh, we're going to separate this so we have a separate, completely separate cargo airport altogether, which is quite exciting. So what we need to do is we need to delete some floor items. So I reckon if I don't, there's a one, two, one, two, one, two, and then I delete here by, I'm going to go by four. Seems quite a lot, but you know, bear with me on this, okay guys, bear with me. And then we're going to get some flooring back down as well. We need some concrete. I believe this is the one, right? Is it this? Oh, no. It's not that city. It's the checkered floor. There we go. To extend and expand our beautiful little cargo section. So let me just double check. Well, actually, before I do that, let me just quickly add the tarmac just here. There we go. And that finalizes just nice. And we have that extra line here, the taxiway to come down to our cargo section. But then again, I could also have the additional runways for... How many runways is too many runways? Let's be honest, guys. I've got four, five, six, seven. Okay, let me know in the comment section right now. What airport in the world has the most runways? Pause the video. Go to Google. Find out. Leave a comment on the video right now. Because I want to know if I've got more runways than the most runway airport in the world. If that made any sense whatsoever. But uh, let me find out anyway. So... Let me get out of this floor mode. So for a... Let's start with the Beluga. And I think the C-17 will be... This, oh, no! Is the C-17 like a... It's a military plane, isn't it? It is an actual military plane. So forget that for just a moment. Uh, the Beluga right now are cargo. So I need a cargo jet parking, which I don't have. Large runway. I do have. A large ATC tower. I do have. And I don't have the Times Free Warehouse shelves. Gotcha. So let's first start then with the parking. So the jetways, we need the cargo jet, which is 800,000. Oh my goodness me, you think I'm made of money right now? The game legit thinks I'm made of money. Right, place you down right there. And then we've now got to build <laughs> the taxiway to it. So if I start here and then come, how far out do I need to go right now? Oh, guys, do I make a separate runway for them? Because if I put them to this, They've got to compete with all these planes going to these runways. When I could build more runways. I'm going to build more runways. He's going to build more runways, boys. Right, bringing this going across them. So, I'm going to have so many freaking runways right now. It's going to be unreal. Uh, and we'll start with the one. We'll start with one first and we'll kind of go from there. 
So I'm bringing that out to here, bringing that out to there, and we'll do like a two space on either side, so there's plenty of room for the cargo airports to kind of uh, dock and unload. So we've got that in, right? We need to kind of build then our new runways. And this is quite expensive. Not gonna lie right now, these large runways are 1.2 million <laughs> a pop. So expensive. Now, is it dangerous to put them here? Yes. Am I going to do it anyway? Yes. Am I foolish? Don't answer that question. Uh, right, so, uh, how many runways would I need for cargo? I reckon two's enough. Two would be enough, wouldn't it? I'm trying to think what I would do over here. What could I possibly do over here? Right, I'm going to place it over here. It's, uh, do you know what? I'm going to go here. It's very dangerous to pull it where I want to pull it. Even though this is going to be very dangerous anyway. But I'm going to place one here. Right, and then I do one here. I would have spent 2.4 million on two runways. Am I am I am I stupid? Slightly. Don't don't answer the question. Uh, right. So bringing this down. Okay, we're gonna complete uh, kind of keep them completely separate uh, up until this point here. The UT full. So, even though we have two runways connected up to this one stand, we still won't get the cargo plane landing, the big beluga. Because I need three of the warehouse shelves. So, where do I get those then? Are they in the build mode section? Um, build mode, jetways, doors, outside, seating, utilities. Ah, there they are! Warehouse shelves. So, hold on. Before I do, before I actually place it down... Do I have a limit? Let me get out of this build mode real quick. How do I not place this down? There we go. Uh, where's my airport stuffs? It's, it's here, isn't it? I've, I've forgotten how to play the game. Um, look at the happiness and comfort right now. It's not looking too good, guys. It's not looking too good. But I think I've got the capacity. Is there a capacity for this? There's not. No. There is no capacity for the cargo plane for the airport, which is good. It just needs the shelves. All right, let's get these shelves in, boys. Let's get these shelves in. So we'll start then placing them. We'll go one. Now, I only need three. I'll place four down just there. So that should be enough then for us to start getting a cargo plane landing. Oh, <gasps> Beluga! Did you see it, guys? Did you see it right now? We have a big boy Beluga uh, landing at your boy's uh, airport. I want to know how much this makes us. We'll figure out how much this makes us, and then we'll get the rest of the cargo planes all rocking and a rolling. So I've got 2.3 million in the bank right now. Kind of rich, but you know, I'm not flexing. I'm not flex. Okay, I'm kind of flexing, but I'm not flexing. So cargo plane is here. Now there should be no delays because at the end of the day, it has two runways. No other plane is going to be landing for it, so we can just skadoodle and go when it pleases. And it's off, guys. It is now off. I always find the belugas hilarious. Obviously, they're named after the beluga whale. But who thought that this would be a perfect design for a plane? Look at its head. It's got a big forehead. <laughs> Sonny X, stop judging the planes. You're going to hurt its feelings. Uh, right, okay. So, it's going to now take off. And if we can, like, gauge this just right, we should be able to see how much money it makes us. 75,000 big ones. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me. Alrighty. Righty. So, I think we need to get the rest of these now in. So, build mode. And how many can I squeeze in will be the good question. So, cargo airport right now. So, we've got to place one there. These are 800,000 a pop, remember. So, we've got to do a two space. One, two. And then that one there. I can only afford one more. So one, two, and then that one there. And now I can only afford half of one. <laughs> but we'll get every goal up and running right now. So we need the flooring for the taxiways. And as soon as these are now connected, we, we're pretty much good to go. The planes can now start landing. We'll be getting 75 big. Oh, hold on. I've realized. I always forget this bit. I always forget that bit there. Because you know what? So dumb. I'm so dumb. But that will allow us to have four planes landing. I mean, I, I'm not saying all four planes are going to be landing at once. 
but it helps. It kind of helps. So I do want to get another one in. Um, that will be fantastic, boys. So let me just figure this out then. So if that is going to be the two space in there, then we're going to have another two space in there for another one. So I need to extend a little bit more just here. And then that is our beautiful cargo airport. Absolutely delicious. Absolutely delicious, boys. So there goes the plane. Skadoodling out of here. Uh, right, so I'm not sure how long... Oh, wait, hold on. Do I need three warehouses per plane? Because only one's landed. Let me see what happens next. Let me see what happens next. Something seems a little bit suspicious, boys. Something seems a little bit suspicious right now. Where are the rest of the planes? Cargo! Land! Right, here comes the one. We should have a second one underway. Aha! There we go! Okay, now we're rocking and rolling, guys. Now we're officially rocking and rolling. So, let's get the rest of all this in. So, I can't afford to get that last stand, but I'll get it in momentarily. Because your boy needs to place down more of these shelves. So, I've got to get all this little section now set up. So, I'm leaving the space between the aisles for where the plane comes directly in. And I've just messed that up. And I've just messed that up. Right as I said it, I messed it up. You can call me a damn fool all you like. But in reality, you're the fool. Um, right, I just realized these are 100,000 each. And I'm dropping them down like I have unlimited money. What am I doing? What am I actually doing right now? Planes, can you land and take off, please? Right, another big boy beluga's on the way. Another big boy beluga. I think the taxi um, way is so long that we'll probably only ever see three belugas at once at any given time. I could be wrong. We could have four. But it's quite the distance. It is quite the distance. Here's two. And then that red one should then disembark. And then we might see another one land. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway! Money being spent. Money being spent. Like I have unlimited money. <laughs> oh, there we go. Three belugas. One there. Two over here. Amazing. Amazing. So, wait for that one to then disappear. And I've got room then to place down two more warehouse shelves. And I'm pretty much happy. I think that will be enough. We'll just kind of finish the rest of it off and see if we can do some configurations to maybe change the taxiing system. Um, to be able to get more planes in. So, you go there. And I just need one more. Which I cannot afford because I am poor boy. Uh, there we go. Bam. Beautiful. Uh, right, sweet, sweet, sweet. And we need to get the tarmac now all down. Boom, ba boom, boom, boom. Boom, ba boom, boom, boom. Uh, which is all done. And the only thing left then is the taxiway. So I'll get the taxiway down here. And I can't get the cargo thing down until I've got 800,000 big ones. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Right, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Glorious. So, like what I've done here, then we've got all these multiple additional ways to go. Does it bring more planes in? I don't know. Uh, you better judge it up. But what I could maybe try and do is figure out alternative ways to bring more of the planes in. Now, if I utilize this and went down to here, it might free up the runway slightly to allow more planes to land. I could be wrong. It could be a complete waste of time. But you gotta you gotta try these things, boys. You gotta try these things right now. Right, I got multiple ways in which we can kind of taxi. So hopefully it frees up the ability to land more balugas. Unless and I mean the only other option then is to build more runways. And that's 1.2 million! You think I got one point you think I you think I got large runway money right now? You are mistaken. You are gravely mistaken. So it takes a while then for it to kind of reconfigure its roots and update. Uh, I think you have to wait for a plane to fully, like, disappear and get out of here for it to then re-update its current new routes. Because I've deleted stuff from before in the past, and planes still take the route, even though there's no taxiway. So you kind of have to give it a little bit of a, uh, a memento. But this is going to be the be-all and all right now, boys. We're going to see the magic appear. But we're making some good cash, though, guys. We're not far off getting the 800,000 needed to get the last cargo section. So we'll see. We'll see what happens next.
I scratch the moustache and we get back to work. <laughs> right, okay. Um, right, we're now waiting. We're waiting for this beautiful plane to freaking land. Come on, belugas. You have four stands. There's two runways and not a single beluga wanting to land right now. Oh, I can buy the last one, boys. I can buy the, the last one. There we go. We are now all belugaed up, but we are currently belugaless. This is great success. Where's the belugas? <laughs> Where are they? Oh my goodness me! I'm now only just realizing. Oh, uh, finally! I'm now just realizing how long that was going to take. But we are now. Uh, we are now. We are no longer belugaless. We have a beluga, and uh, we now play the waiting game. So we're just waiting for the next one to kind of come in and land. So that's taking uh, that route. Beautiful, uh, beautiful. Uh, and where is the others? Can you hurry up, please? Can you hurry up, please? Oh, there we go. No one's coming in. No one's coming in. So that's on our new stand. I've literally just placed that one. Double belugas. <laughs> Double belugs, boys. Double belugs. Well, they're taking my new routes. Uh, where are you going, sir? And where are you going right now? Oh my goodness me, that was chaotic. So chaotic right there. What is going on? Who are you? That was hilarious. <laughs> so we should see this one then disembark, unless another one decides it wants to land. But three belugas in one go. Amazing, boys. Absolutely amazing. Uh, and that one now disappears. So, great success. We've now built our very own cargo airport. Yay! But the only thing this airport does not have is the military planes. And that, if I look at it, requires tanks. Yes. If you want to see me build or add in the additional cargo, no, military airplanes and build a military base, smash that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new. And until next time, I see you all soon. So goodbye.